Ha! Hey everyone, Hassan here. Welcome to the world of Ha. Today I got another one up box unboxing video for you. This is for the month of January 2016. So, this is the first one up box for 2016, which is really exciting. So, I'm just gonna open this thing up and we're gonna take a look. So, for those that don't know, the One Up Box is a box of random goodies that you get each month. And, you know, it's anything from like comic book stuff to video games, movies, all sorts of different uh, nerdy things, which is really cool. And so, if you are interested, link in the description box below to sign up, so check it out. I've been doing these for a while and usually there's some really cool stuff inside, especially their exclusive shirts. Every box has an exclusive shirt, which is awesome. So, dun 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 dun. Now, each month there's also a theme. So, I don't know what this month's theme is. Let me see if I can fish around and try and find something that has a theme on it. Oh, here's the pin. So, every month there's a pin that has a theme, and this month's theme is Legend. Ooh, I'm already liking this. So, it's got a Pokeball with Mew sleeping inside. That'll focus right there. So, that's pretty cool. Pretty cool little pin right there. All right, okay, I dig it, I dig it. What else we got? I'm not even looking at it yet. I can kind of see it through the camera. What is this? Oh, this is cool. So we got something from the vinyl collection right here. Marvel Series 1 Vinyl Collectible. And so, uh, yeah, I got Deadpool. So that's pretty cool. It says, uh, Dorbs. I guess that's like the brand number six. I don't know if they're called Dorbs because they're adorable. Ha! <laughs> Maybe, I don't know. <laughs> Alright, here we go. Let's see. Let's open this thing up. I don't know too much about Deadpool, I'm gonna be honest with you, but the, uh, the movie trailers seem interesting, that's for sure. Very unlike any other superhero, I think, out there. So this is definitely interesting. Um, so yeah, here's the, uh, the, the vinyl collectible right here for Deadpool. It's pretty sweet. So the head rotates all the way around, and that's about it. Um, so that's pretty neat. Pretty neat. So you can kind of have them like, you know, sitting on your desk or a nice little display piece. So there's a whole bunch of different kinds. So again, series one, there's Deadpool, but there's all different kinds on the side of the box, as it mentions right there. Um, that's pretty cool. Oh, they do have Spider Man. Spider Man's my favorite, so that would have been cool to get him. But Deadpool's still neat. All right. So. That's that. Next we got Zero to Hero Coffee. So it's like a Starbucks parody, but it's a Zero to Hero Coffee. Is that like based off of something? I feel like it's like based off of something and I just don't know what it is. Also, I don't drink coffee, so... <laughs> but, for those that do, pretty handy. It's a little, uh, you know pouch that you can kind of put your, your coffee in and it'll keep it warm. Uh, pretty comfy too, which is nice. So that's pretty cool. Not sure exactly what that's supposed to represent, but pretty neat nonetheless, especially for coffee drinkers, but I'm not a coffee drinker, but still kind of cool. I'm sure I could use it for, uh, I do drink lots of chocolate milk, hot chocolate, especially during the winter time. So I like that. Ooh, what is this? Super Mario dog tag plus foil trading card and decal sticker, look for gold tags. So it's got Yoshi on the package right there. I just saw like a big Yoshi and I was like, whoa, that's so cool. And the back shows you a whole bunch of different dog tags that you can get. And I guess there's special like uh, gold ones and rare ones inside. So each pack contains a dog tag, a 24 inch ball chain, a foil trading card, and a decal sticker. Gold finish series tags appear one every eight. Also look for deluxe dog tags collector binders. Okay, there's a whole bunch of like binders and stuff you can do to collect them. So one in every eight packs has a gold one. So let's see what happens. Dun, 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 dun. Knowing my luck with like booster packs and all that kind of stuff, I have terrible luck with those things. So I'm not expecting to get anything good, but you know, it's Super Mario. So let's see what it is. Here we go. What is it? It's not a gold one. I can't even tell what it is. I'm gonna open it up. Oh, it's a, uh, okay, one of the, uh, so it's Lemmy Koopa. Uh, that's really interesting looking. So here's, I got Lemmy Koopa. So you can see it right there. From New Super Mario Bros. U. 
pretty cool. I'm gonna be honest with you, and I'm sure a lot of people are gonna be like, what? I don't know all of their the names for the Koopa Kids, or the Koopalings, or that's interchangeable, right? Koopa Kids, Koopalings. I know, I'm terrible, everybody's gonna hate me for it. I know, like, if I see them, I know who they are, like, they're in Smash Brothers too and everything, and they're pretty sweet, but, uh, I don't know, like, each of their names. <laughs> I know, that's terrible. But, Lemmy Koopa, pretty cool. Like, you could tell me, like, if someone were to say, is Lemmy Koopa a, an actual Koopa kid or not? Like, I would know, but like, I wouldn't know which is which, if that makes sense. Um, okay, I got a collectible card of Mario, and it's all bent up, which is kind of annoying, but um, looks cool, though. So there's Mario, but it's kind of like bent up. I don't know if you can see it. I don't know how all well that shows, but, uh, it's shiny though, I like it. And the back has, it says Hero, New Super Mario Bros. U, and it has a little description about Mario, as if you don't know who that is. So you can pause the video and read that if you are so inclined. Um, but yeah, interesting. And so then, oh, you got this little decal right here. That's kind of cool. I like that. The Bowser Jr. decal right there. I dig it, I dig it. Don't know what I would use this for exactly, but pretty cool. And then you have your checklist of all the dog tags and everything inside. Um, pretty sweet. So a whole bunch of different types and there's a whole checklist and all that stuff right there. So um, yeah, really cool. Huh, interesting. So I'm not gonna waste too much time on, uh, on all of that, but uh, you guys get the idea. Um, pretty cool, pretty cool. You guys know I'm a big Nintendo fan, so that's that's always cool to get Nintendo stuff. Then, ooh, this is cool. It's a little like patch, but it's uh, Legend of Zelda themed. It looks like. So it's like it's a uh, Link sitting on a throne. I'm assuming this is themed like some other show, maybe Game of Thrones. I don't know. I don't watch Game of Thrones. I assumed it's themed after something else too, uh, but it looks really cool though. I do dig the uh, dig the design. That's pretty sweet. I like it. Nice. Oops. Pretty sweet. All right, what else we got here? I'm like saving the t-shirt for last. Uh, all right, you know what? All right, what the heck? Let's just go for the t-shirt. So the t-shirts are always top notch. So let's see what we got this month for the legend theme. Um. <laughs> So here's the uh, here's the T-shirt for this month, Pugs of Legend. So there's the design right there. You guys can see Pugs of Legend. Um, huh? Wait, are these supposed to be themed after something certain specific? Because that almost looks like it's supposed to be like a fake dragon dagger or something from Power Rangers. I don't know. That's really interesting looking. Yeah, I'm not sure specifically what this is supposed to be themed after. Um, let me know in the comment section below what you guys think, but yeah, you know, it's uh, it's not bad, but this is probably the first shirt from 1UP Box that's like, okay, for me personally. Other people may love it, because um, it is a cool looking shirt. I just don't fully get it, <laughs> um, you know, but that's not to say it's a bad thing because 1UP Box consistently has had really, really good stuff, really good shirts, so, um, you know, so there's bound to be a box that it's not going to wow me like this one, uh, but hey, it's still neat nonetheless. Uh, then we got <clears throat> a Valentine's Day card. Ha! <laughs> Okay, I like this. So this is uh, themed after Thor. It says, to whoever holds this hammer, if they be worthy, shall possess my love. Happy Valentine's Day. That is funny. That is funny. <laughs> I should send this to my, uh, my fiance. <laughs> that's, that's funny. Um, all right, what else we got? So now you have the little insert that kind of describes everything. So it says Legend 1UP Box right here. Uh, this is interesting designs on, I always love the little crossovers they have. So they have like a link, but on a cloud almost. And they have a, looks like Thor wearing like Luigi stuff, kind of. It's like, it's so interesting how they do all their crossovers. That's so weird. Uh, so 
Deadpool Dorbs. Uh, oh, so it looks like everybody got Deadpool in the 1-Up box. Okay, so usually when they get these things, it's random. Some boxes may have different ones, but everybody gets Deadpool, so that's interesting. Super Mario Dog Tag, Zero to Hero Can Cooler, um, featuring your favorite Greek legend. So is that just supposed to be like Hercules or something? I don't know. <laughs> Game of Legend Patch. So I assume they don't, they don't outright say it, but I guess it must be Game of Thrones related. Uh, Valentine's Day card, uh, Pugs of Legend shirt, our exclusive shirt features a cute leak of Pugs. We'll certainly will have you LOLing. Um, well, no, it didn't, but hey, you know, it's the thought that counts. So this month, uh, really cool, interesting stuff. Um, definitely uh, pretty neat. I, I kind of dig the, uh, the Thor, like, Valentine's thing. It's kind of funny. Uh, for me, personally, the highlight is the Mario stuff. I love Mario, so I think uh, the card is, is kind of cool looking, and I like the little dog tag as well. Um, so that's pretty neat. Uh, but, you know, it's always nice to have more shirts, definitely. So can't go wrong with another t-shirt. So I will definitely be wearing this as well. So pretty sweet. Anyways, that's that, guys. That's another 1UP Box unboxing video. First one of 2016. Not the best 1UP Box, you know, going to be completely honest. But still pretty decent and still, you know, pretty interesting. And so I'm excited. I think next month's theme is Transform. And that sounds, just the theme sounds really cool. So I'm excited about that. So, uh, yeah, if you guys like this video, please give this a thumbs up. Please share the video and subscribe because I will be doing more 1UP Box unboxing videos as they come. So thank you all so much for watching, and I will see you later. So I was looking at the Super Mario Dog Tag checklist, and so in case you guys are curious as to what cards, or rather what dog tags are, uh, you know, on the checklist and everything, there's a whole list here. You probably can't even see it. But it looks like they have a 2D Bowser, Donkey Kong, Luigi, Mario, Princess Peach, and Yoshi. Those are the gold ones, which is pretty cool. Uh, and then there's deluxe dog tags and all these trading cards. There's a whole bunch, actually. So 12 different decal stickers, lots of interesting things to collect. So that's pretty cool. So uh, yeah, if you guys are interested, I kind of dig these Super Mario dog tags. I don't, I don't know that I'm going to collect them because I have so much else that I'm collecting, but they're definitely worth looking into, uh, especially if you're a Mario fan. I think these look pretty cool, and it'd be neat to have a whole collection of these. Like, imagine just hanging them all somewhere. That'd be pretty sweet looking. So if you guys are interested, check these out and, and see which ones you get. And if you do, let me know in the comment section which, uh, which dog tags you get because uh, these are pretty cool. Anyways, thank you all so much for watching, and I will see you later.